so, you know, and I don't want to give everything away about this because, it, but I'm s yeah, also intensely curious without seeing the movie. So, first of all, where and how did you hear about the blackout experiments? I saw an article about extreme haunted houses. I was extremely curious about what oh, that was. My and they're, kid and will they're love a big this. deal here in Utah. Haunted, haunted houses. Haunted houses. Yeah. haunted houses are a big deal, but extreme haunted houses is a thing unto That's itself. A different thing, I'll, yeah. I'll bet my son has heard of these because he's way into haunted houses. I hope he's over right. 18. No, nope. <laughs> I'm not going to let him see the movie. I don't want to let him see the movie. So, right. so where, where are these? Well, Blackout originated in New York, and they eventually started doing performances also in Los Angeles. And the deal with Blackout is that you have to go in alone. You have to be over 18. You're asked to sign a waiver once you get there, and you're given a safe word in case it gets too intense for you. So it's a very extreme experience. It's for adults. It hits on a lot of taboo subjects, and it's extremely disturbing. Mm -hmm. that, does yeah. it cross we, the line? It crosses yeah. a lot of lines. Yeah. Uh, well, you know, now we have something kind of in a very minor way that was introduced to haunted houses here uh, a few years ago now where they do, it used to be that the actors would never touch you, mm -hmm. and now they do hands-on. If you wear and, a special, like, glow-in-the-dark yeah. necklace or and something. You have to sign a waiver, and you wear, you wear a, uh, mm -hmm. like, a glow-in-the-dark thing that says, I'm here for the hands-on experience. But this is and way they'll, <laughs> they'll rough you up a little bit. I mean, they will. They'll drag you around and rough you up. But this is way beyond that. I'm worried about the people that work in these places. <laughs> no, oh, no, 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 they're, no, 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 Gina. They're having a hell of a good time. No, no, but that's what I'm worried about. Are these people that have, <laughs> like... No, I'm serious. Like, like maybe murderous tendencies that maybe want to... No, no yeah. Blackout is hiring actors, and they're very good actors, okay. and they are very good at making you incredibly scared and uncomfortable. It's very verbally abusive to be inside there, so you basically just feel uncomfortable the whole time that you're in there. They have a knack for being able to manhandle you in just the right way up to the line without actually injuring oh. you. Okay. Do they... Um, but So they, they, there's never any question of crossing the lines of legality or is there well from blackout's <laughs> point of view i think they would say no they're not crossing the line of legality probably some people that come out of there if they have a really bad experience might Disagree. feel there's a question there <laughs> now is this the first time again i'm in, i'm immersed in this stuff in my personal life because my son loves mm -hmm. haunted houses and wants to run one someday and he builds yeah. props and he acts in them and all of that so, so I'm kind of, and my guess is he's heard of this and, and has he seen. He probably has. Uh, so, uh, when you both, did you both experience it? And that would just be me. I'm too big a chicken. And, and <laughs> I so wouldn't do it. I, I don't. I, I wouldn't. I, do I got it. nothing against you. <laughs> I would not do this. So, Rich, what was it like for you? Um, well, it was very intense and it was very scary. But the other thing I realized when I went through it is it's really more of a psychological experience. They're really getting inside your mind and you do a lot, you end up thinking about your own issues a lot. So in that way, it almost becomes a self exploration a little bit. I can guarantee you this is gonna be happening in Salt Lake within the next couple of years. H how long guarantee are you, it. how long are you in there? You're in there. It like, varies, like it can be as short as 20 minutes. It can be as long as an hour and they do some, you know, special invitation only shows that can go a lot longer. Mm -hmm. I, I guarantee you. We will see this in Salt Lake. I want nothing to do with it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, well, I'll see, I'm, actually, I'm afraid to see the movie. <laughs> when you say you're going to get this in Salt Lake, um, Blackout actually is here for the festival, and they are doing a performance in the tonight. Kickstarter space tonight. Uh, oh, uh, man. Uh, I, see, and I know people, some of the people who run the haunted houses in Salt Lake, uh, they probably are up here to see what this is all about, and you're gonna, I, I'll guarantee you you're going to Now, do they, they make good dough doing this? Yeah, how much I, does it honestly, cost? Honestly, so. it's surprisingly affordable to go through. Oh, really? really? Surprisingly affordable, <laughs> considering what a custom-bespoke experience that it is. That surprises me. Yeah. That surprises me that it's affordable. And okay. So they're, and somebody's making, they're making money doing this, I would think. Yeah, yeah we haven't ever talked about... You know, yeah, we haven't gotten into the finances with them too much, mm -hmm. but, I mean, this is their passion, this is their art, this is what they're trying to make a living doing. I mean, I'll, I'll see the movie. I will never go through one of these things. I'm telling you right now. Uh, when people come and see the Blackout Experiments, which is uh, midnight showings uh, here at the Sundance Film Festival, is it pretty close to experiencing it? 
we're trying as much as possible in the movie to present it in a cinematic way and have it be a very visceral experience. It's not a traditional documentary. You're not going so much to learn about blackout behind the scenes as you are going to experience blackout. It's from the point of view of the people that go through it, their experiences. We followed people who went through over two years of their experiences with blackout and how their experience develops over time and they gets more coming, obsessive. They, they come back for more and over more and, and more. Over it becomes and addictive. Over. Did, and, we, and. did we get to watch you go through? Uh, you will not get to watch me go through, <laughs> but I'm happy to give you all the gory details when the mics aren't Let's here. turn the mics off. And <laughs> I want to talk about this. Uh, uh, you I can guarantee you we will have this for sure in Salt Lake in a year or so. Thanks a lot. Uh, Rich Fox and Chris Curry uh, sounds fascinating. I hope it goes well, and thanks for being here. Thanks for having thanks us. Thanks a lot.